Here's our salt water tank. We had some friends over and they just loved it. They thought it was so cool. So David's thinking maybe it's time to get a couple of fishies. We'll have to see. I would like to get a couple more um, shrimp. I really enjoy watching the shrimp personally. David really wants me to watch. Was it 365 days of reefing? Yep. It's amazing how much our son has learned off of YouTube all about fish and amazing how his brain. <laughs> oh, there's one of those little like see-through shrimpy guys. Let's see if I can we can see him better. Go down here. Right there. Can you see him? Should I try to zoom in, maybe? I don't know. Let's try. It's right there. They're cool dudes. Very cool. And then we have one of the little sexy shrimp back there. Did Aunt Nettie come out? I haven't seen him. Well, he's okay. Here's our little friend, the sea anemone. I don't know if we ever got a name for him. Maybe the wanderer. He is always wandering. Kind of looks like a porcupine, though. What's your favorite in here, Michael? Do you have a favorite coral or shrimp? Um, I kind of like all of them. I really love the big cleaner shrimp. Yes. And here comes one of the little hermit crabs. Hello, Hermie. How are you today? It looks pretty big, though. So we're thinking we're going to have to go to that fish place and see what they got going on. I feel like they had a coral swap fairly recently. So come back over here to Mr. Shrimp. Such a cool little dude. Such a cool dude. All of his long antennas. Yeah, definitely got character, that's for sure. So I hope everyone's keeping well this winter. And here in the States, we've been having, oh my goodness, cases of, we've had friends with RSV and pneumonia and COVID. So... Michael had come down with, I don't know, bad head cold for about a week, but gave him all the good food. Good food is medicine and ginger and garlic and herbs and thankfully he got to feeling better and then David got sick for about a week and he took all the the good things and got better too and somehow my daughter and I avoided the plague thank goodness for that yep, no but you know what we get acupuncture a lot more often so maybe that that could be what helped our immune system to not get how, it possibly how, how is the wanderer in his ankle you got any hats the wanderer I don't see any hats on him today no that's unusual he's usually like 20 no Michael took me the other week, it, the day that it was warm, we went to the lakes, and that was nice. You know, indoors, in the wintertime, people are indoors a lot more, so. Whenever we have a nice day, I say snag it, get some fresh air, and... He's pretty cool in the back, I like them. They are. I always feel better when I get out and... Nature helps my anxiety greatly. Greatly. But hey, when it's too cold or crummy outside, I can look at my beautiful nature in my tank.
So everyone, take care out there. Should we sign off for now, Michael? What do you think? Yep. Sign All right. For now. Come back another day. Come back another day. All right, guys. That was our our little update around these parts. This neck of the woods, as they say. I'll let the shrimpy sign off. Anything you'd like to say before we go, Mr. Shrimpy? Nope, apparently not. I think he's just saying, thank you for the food. Thank you for the shrimp pellets. You're welcome, my dude, you're welcome. <laughs>